Do you think I'm smart? Yeah. Do you think I'm pretty? Yeah. You know my friend Chris? Do you think I'm like as cool as her? You know, it's uh, pretty early. Do you want to go somewhere? There's like this record shop. Maybe we could go there, pick up something new. Something like that. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work out. What? Yeah, sorry. Really thought we could have had something here too, but... I'm going up to Oregon this summer, so it's like I'm not going to see you that much or whatever. Goodbye forever. See you in English. I'm not going to Oregon this summer. I wish I was going to Oregon. <laughs> 44 minutes and 4 seconds worth of Debussy on this record. I've grown up with it, my mom's favorite. Some of his best, some say. What does that even mean, his best? Like you're putting this guy's life in six songs. I never let it finish, it's too quiet without it. Everyone talks about Debussy's use of silence in his pieces, how everything seems to come from nowhere, so subtle yet so deliberate. He must have been really comfortable with silence. Imagine that. I can hear it now. It sounds like everything I want. It sounds like love. I think Christine's worried about me. She shouldn't be. She thinks I'm serial dating. Christine tells me I should learn to be happy outside a relationship before getting into one. Something about a moral obligation. What does she know? You know, if you drink too much orange juice, you're gonna throw up. I think that's milk. Oh. You know, you're being kind of weird at the party, but just so you know. Is this about me and James? Uh, is this about me and James? Christine, not everything's about you and James. Well, is it though? No. Okay. Because I like him. I don't, so... Well, you will, because I'm going to have you and James over before Lauren's thing tomorrow night. Oh, I don't want to go to Lauren's thing. She's been all weird since she bleached her hair. Too confident, She's maybe. She's totally cool. Plus, she likes you, and she complimented your jacket last week. She so, so doesn't. And I can't even make it. I have a date that night. You don't have a date. You should just come. I know you're free. You know, you're super obsessed with me. It's not a good look. But yeah, fine. I'll go. <laughs> you should be happy, you know? I'm usually very anti-relationship. Hardly like it's a choice. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Well, it's this whole serial dating thing. I, it's like you don't know what you want. I know what I want. I know what I want. So I don't know, like, I don't want to tell her she can't bring guys to the dorms, but they're literally like 70 and up. But that's so cool though. You're going to be roommates with a sugar baby? I don't know, it's intense. Like, it's cool if it's happening to you, but otherwise, like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna really miss you, Chris. Like, a lot. I miss you too. I'm going to be all alone my senior year. I have no friends. I know, and whenever I mention your name to other people, they just tell me how much they hate you. Really? Yeah, <laughs> everybody, and whenever I talk about really? you more, they just start to projectile vomit. Mm -hmm. I think it's all over the oh, walls. Yeah? We have to clean it up. But that smell, it like, <laughs> lingers, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Totally. It's really inconvenient, especially for the janitors. Two months? Yeah, two months. I don't know what you're talking about. Camp Rock 2 is like objectively so much better. No, Camp Rock 1 was the classic. Camp Rock 2 is just them selling You out. just called it Camp no. Rock 1. That like proves the second film is more no, powerful. It's just, Did you just call it a film, James? What the fuck? Um, I'm gonna go check up on the cats. Do 
Look, Mel, not to overstep anything, but that was kind of rude. What? It's not my fault you can't take cues like you're some sort of underdeveloped chimp thing. Maybe I'll go check on Christine. Maybe you won't. If anyone's gonna check up on her, it's gonna be me, okay? I'm her boyfriend. Like that means anything in high school. Look, I get that you're friends. Best friend. Best friends? But we've got a good thing going on right now. We're okay. And when we go off to college, we'll be looking out for each other. And Mel? What? Who's gonna be looking after you? You know, tonight was fun. It was like really good. I know, right? And her hair actually looks all like cute, all bleached. <laughs> I think I might bleach my hair again. Oh, please don't. I'm glad you talked to James. It's just, I like him, like a lot, like a lot. And it's just like this morning, I thought about chopping off all my hair, but then I thought of him, and then I didn't really want to anymore. And I just want that for you. I feel like a bad person these days. I miss my friends. But my date's coming over in a few.